Hello everyone, welcome to MSFT webcast. In this video, we are going to see the steps on how to create custom address list in Exchange 2019. An address list in Exchange is a collection of mail enabled recipient objects. Address lists aren't static, they are updated dynamically. When we create or modify recipients in our Exchange organization, they are automatically added to appropriate address list. When we install Exchange Server in an organization, there are some address lists are created automatically by default like default global address list, all contacts, all users, all rooms, etc. The built-in global address list automatically created by Exchange includes every mail enabled object in the Active Directory forest. An Exchange organization might contain thousands of recipients so the built-in address list could become quite a large. To prevent this, we can create custom address list to help users to find what they are looking for. Custom address list is used to group recipients based on organization's department, location or any other criteria so that it is easier for users to find the recipients. Let's take a scenario that our company has several departments and I want to create one separate custom address list for our marketing department. First, we are going to use Windows PowerShell to get the list of users who are in currently marketing department. Let's go to Windows PowerShell and here I have typed the command get-user-filter and department is equal to marketing. And these are the users from the marketing department. So we are going to create one custom address list for marketing department that contains these users. Fine. In this guide, we are going to use Exchange Admin Center to create custom address list. And for that, on Exchange 2019 mailbox server, we are going to open Internet Explorer and type https colon double slash localhost slash ecp to access Exchange Admin Center. Let's click on more information and click on go on to the web page. Sign in with the credential of our administrator. In the Exchange Admin Center web interface, first of all, we need to click on organization and then after we need to click on address list. Here we can see the list of default address list which are created by Exchange itself. All contacts, all distribution list, all rooms, all users, default global address list and a public folder. To create a new custom address list, we need to click on a plus sign. Let me maximize it. And first we need to specify a name for our custom address list. Here I'm giving name marketing users. If you want, you can specify address list path as well. And for that, you need to click on browse button and select the existing address list inside you are creating a new address list and that we are not going to do. We want to create one separate custom new address list. Now next, we need to select the recipients which we want to include in our address list. We are not going to include all recipients and that's why I'm going to select radio button in front of only the following recipients type. And in that, I'm going to select the checkbox users with exchange mailboxes. And then after we need to specify rule to define the criteria. And for that, we need to click on add a rule button. From the drop down menu, we need to select the criteria which we are going to set up. In this guide, we are going to create address list for marketing department. And that's why I'm going to click on department. If you want, you can also specify other criteria as well. Like uh, you can also specify a custom attributes inside the property of user mailbox. Let's specify our department, which is a marketing. Let's click on plus sign. Perfect. So if you want to include multiple word phrase, you can specify here. Now I'm going to click on OK button. And now let's click on preview recipients. The address list includes. And these are the user mailboxes, which are going to include in our new address list. Let's click on OK. And let's click on save. It is giving us a warning that you need to manually update the list. 
click on OK and perfect. Here you can verify our marketing users address list has been created successfully but it is not up to date. To update this uh, custom address list we need to select it and then after we need to click on update link. It will give us the again a warning dialog box that might take a long time to update this address list. Click on yes to continue and perfect the address list has been successfully updated. Click on close and now here we can verify that marketing users address list is up to date. Now we can repeat the same steps to create another custom address list for other departments as well. After creating custom address list, now the user can see the address list in the directory while composing the new email. Let's verify that and for that I'm going to open Google Chrome and let's access Outlook on the web. We are going to use the credential of our user Jaisa. Let's click on sign in. Let's click on new to compose a new mail. Let's click on two. And here we can see new custom address list name marketing users. And here you can see the list of all the users from marketing department. So in this way we can create custom address list in Exchange 2019 based on recipients department. That's all for this video on how to create custom address list in Exchange Server 2019. Thank you all for watching this video. Have a nice day.